We are tracking a developing story tonight as the motocross community is grieving one of its own. Early this morning, the medical examiner released the identity of a man killed in a shooting over the weekend after deputies say he and his son got into an altercation with a security guard on federal land. Yeah, police say it ended with both men getting shot. Creme 2 Shannon Mowdy has the new developments tonight. We have now learned John Franklin is the man who was killed Saturday in Meade. The Spokane County Sheriff's Office says he was shot by a security officer. But that still leaves many unanswered questions tonight for the motocross community he was closest to. In the shadow of mountains, piles of dirt are trucked into an otherwise quiet motocross park in Airway Heights, preparing another ride. For Josh Hitchens family. <laughs> we're one big, we're one big family. We all care about each other. So it's a pretty big deal. A big deal. It'll be the first ride without John Franklin, one of the fixtures of Airway Motocross Park. Hitchens says for the nine years he's run this place, John was here. Riding dirt bikes, that's what we do out here. Franklin and his sons would come out nearly every weekend on the dirt hours before anyone else. Walk the track, check the track out, help water, pick rocks. The Spokane County Sheriff's Office reports Franklin was approached by a security guard Saturday, suspected of trespassing on federal land near Bonneville Power Administration. Didn't really know what happened. We just saw a picture of their truck. Um, everybody recognized it. I actually text John immediately um, just saying, you know, um, there's some crazy stuff going around and Hope you guys are okay. Um, you know, not even knowing that, you know, that he was already gone. BPA tells Creme 2 News it's aware of the incident with one of its contracted security guards and is cooperating with law enforcement. Hitchens and other family friends say Franklin and his teenage son were near BPA to ride dirt bikes. But the MX community really uh, took the place over and there was never, ever any problems riding there. Um, you know, I've personally been riding out there, ridden right by sheriffs, and they never even pumped the brakes. The sheriff's office reports witnesses saw a physical fight between Franklin, his son, and the security officer before the shooting. The investigation isn't over yet. You know, hopefully uh, through discovery, you know, the full story will come out. Until then, Hitchens is preparing another ride to support his motocross family. We're going to do our best to help support him. The motocross park is planning fundraisers, including this Sunday. All the practice fees and any donations from riders will go to the Franklin family. We have also learned from family friends, including Hitchens. Tonight, Franklin's son, the other man who was shot, is recovering from gunshot wounds to his leg and wrist. Shannon Mowdy, Creme 2 News.